Hey guys, what's up? I'm Tater, and we're back in Satisfactory. We took a video break. We did a Fortnite Duos Phil game. We met some kid, FaZe Pokey. We played with him for a few matches. But we're back in episode 4 of here. And if you guys remember the last episode, I was stranded over there in the northeast area. We found like the, the drop pod thingy. And we... It couldn't open it because we needed power in order to do it so then I came down here we'll talk about that in a second I came back I made it. I didn't die again and we did all of these tier 1 upgrades so we got this stuff you know I'm not gonna use it cause I probably won't try and make it all look nice and everything we got these which are really helpful we got this which I really needed these two things right here um let's see we also we got this, and I needed the assembler and these things, but you'll see why in a second. So, this, the MAM. You take whatever you find, so like the green power slugs, and you do research on these things, which gave me power shards, which are in my inventory over here, which I'll show you what they do. I haven't researched any food yet. Don't even know how I got this, but I did research on it. I haven't done flower petals yet, which I can do flower petals because I have them in my thing. I just haven't yet. And we did alien skins and stuff, which I'm trying to get these pretty soon, which is like a gun. And this one, which gives me an extra slot in my hand so I can switch to more things easier. Okay, but the thing is, this right here, these power shards let me put them into things i don't think i can put it in over there and i can't jump up here all right jeez i'm having problems all right that lets me put things into like the assemblers the constructors the miners and the biomass burners which lets me go farther like this one is and it's still going because we ran out of power so it has um, not sure how long it has. I think this was a green power slug, so it goes for 7.5 per minute. I, I actually, I don't know what that means. I don't know how long it lasts. But we, we did something else that is it's pretty big, to say the least. But before we get to that, we found another drop pod that we're going to go to over in this direction. And hopefully you guys don't see what I, I did off camera. But if you can't tell in my voice, it is like 1, one twenty in the morning, something like that. And I'm going to show you guys what I built. And I'm going to give it power with all this, uh, what's it called? Solid biofuel with all of that. And we are going to put the power shards in it. Man, it's early. I can't think. We're going to put the power shards in it and let it go overnight. That way it just crafts a ton of the stuff that we needed. And I'm also going to craft by hand all of this biofuel into solid, bio, or biomass into solid biomass. Um, trying to remember where I need to go without showing you guys. Because it's like what I built is right to my left. So I don't want to show you guys anything because... What I did isn't small. I think it's right up there. Is that that's where we're going for the the drop pod thing. I have never opened one of these, so I don't know what's in it. Hopefully, it gives me some food, like these berries over here, because I'm about to die. I have three hearts left. Hopefully, we can get some of these. <clears throat> get these eaten. But boom! All right. Also, in the first video, at the, the end of it, I said that I was going to play Avengers, and I was going to make videos on it and do the story, but I don't think I am anymore, just because... Oh, God. Yeah. Get away from me. Just because I don't like how they, how they did it, and it doesn't look that interesting to me anymore. Oh, here's the drop pod. I'll keep talking about that after we figure this out. Uh, I need to put this down somewhere. 
Oh, I don't have any of the stuff. Okay. We are going to run back to the base and grab the stuff that I need to make this biomass burner. And then I also need cables so I can connect it. Oh, God. Alright, but yeah, back to the thing. I... I don't like how they did it, because you have to pay for a $60 game, which is fine. And it's a story mode game and whatever. I don't like how they made you get a battle pass for each character to get the characters like Iron Man, Superman, or not Superman, <laughs> Iron Man, I thought that was going to kill me, um, Iron Man, Thor, Captain America, you have to buy a $10 battle pass to get them, and skins and stuff for them. I don't like how they did that because you have to pay $60 for the game. If you were going to do that, put like an in-game store and hopefully this guy doesn't kill me. Put an in-game store that you don't have to pay for. And you get stuff by just playing the game like they do in... Um, uh, what's the game called? In Fall Guys. Because you paid $20 for the game, but everything in the game you can, you don't have to pay for with real money. Unless you buy the DLC packs, but you can get skins and stuff without having to use money. Which, that's how they should have done it. And I don't like how it's a story mode game with a battle pass. That just doesn't make any sense to me whatsoever. Because that's taken away from the story mode game. And... I feel like they only added that because every game's doing that right now, so they felt like they had to, to get their game out there. I don't know, it's just not something that I'm looking forward to, so I'm not going to play it. But what I am going to play, two upcoming games that I'm probably going to play the one that comes out first, finish that series, and then play the next one. So the second game that I might play might be a little bit delayed, just because... Uh, just because how long it might take me to play the other one. And those games are... Oh, wait, I need Wire 2. There we go. I'm going to be playing Cyberpunk 2077. And I think that one comes out first before the other game that I'm going to play. And the other game I'm going to play is Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Both super good looking games that I like. Uh, I've never played an Assassin's Creed game, just because they've never really interested me, but the Valhalla one does, because, you know, it's it's Odin, stuff like that, Thor, Loki, yeah. And, I don't know, that seems like a one that I would like. I mean, I think I would like the other ones too, but, eh. We're just gonna start off with Valhalla. Hope I don't need anything. We're gonna run back over to where we just were open up that supply crate, then I'm going to show you guys what I made, put the power in it, show you guys how to use the power shards, and then we are going to cut till the morning. Because I'm tired, and I was prepping this for about three hours, maybe. Two hours, three hours, I don't know, I lost track of time, guys. It, it's been a while. I've been building, running around, crafting a lot of stuff it's, it's a lot hopefully this drop gives me something good I really hope it does but yeah cyberpunk and Valhalla I think they both come out in November I could be wrong I know cyberpunk does I'm not fully sure about Valhalla and that's why I can't get up here. That's why uh, Valhalla, because that's the second game that comes out, might be a little bit delayed from playing. Because I'll finish Cyberpunk before I do that. Um, All right, yeah, that was the drop pod that we need. This, so we have to go like that. Put power. Put that in there. One quick five. Uh, okay, I thought I just had to put power in it. Well, this was um, um, waste of time. All right, so need to figure out how to get 
quick wire where it's gonna drop down. Do not take too much damage. Yeah, I can feed that. Boom, back up to full health. And we're gonna show you what what I was doing on my own time for a while. About three hours today. It it's interesting. I found this area right in front of me. You can see all the three miners right there. That's that's a later thing that we're gonna deal with. I might just break those and not use them, but there are five iron mines right here. And I'm using two of them right now. There's another mine on the other side of the three, but I had to demolish the miner over there because it just I needed the parts for it. So this is what I got going on. So I have two miners and they're both attached to two to one splitter and I just have it going off two directions because I don't need six smelters but I got four smelters up these are all gonna smelt them down and we got this making iron bars and this making iron plates then iron bar bars being put into here to make screws these are being brought over here to make uh, reinforced plates and I need to set up just space right here I'm just gonna put two uh, storage containers right here so that one's making reinforced plates but this one we have um, iron rods being made again being made into screws and more iron rods make being made right there and this is gonna come over here to make routers which I'm gonna need a lot of later on so we're gonna start these up hopefully at first I only had three biomass burners but I wasn't sure if that'd be enough so hopefully these four work we're gonna turn the power off actually let me turn it on boom 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 we don't blow a fuse yeah I think we're good everything's yellow perfect all right so for these if you look down here we have the clock speed so the higher it goes the faster we'll be making stuff but the more fuel it's gonna be burning the lower it goes the opposite the less fuel the less it'd be putting out so we're gonna put one there two there and put it all the way up to 200% clock speed so it's just pumping out stuff okay then we're gonna come over here put two in here so this is also just cranking stuff out come over here put two in here now, yeah okay so it's not it's going down pretty good but not too much come over here oh got to put them in put those in bam put it in so if we look over here, why is it? Oh, because it's going so quick that the smelters don't even have time to to do that. Okay, so it's pumping this out pretty quick. Um, uh, yeah, it's going faster than it could put it out, which is which is good. And then we're getting a lot of these nice and a lot of screws are being made a lot of plates are being made a lot of metal rods and we're getting these going which are nice and that's going which is nice and we're gonna do that hopefully can we make these right now yep we have the stuff too all right we're just gonna put line that up not as worried about this one Line that one up. Put that there so that can just start going into it. Put that one there. So we got this going. And I needed a lot of. Is it. I can't remember what I needed to put into my um, space elevator, which lets me get the tier 3 and 4 upgrades. So start. We gotta make some stuff, but the stuff that goes in there I can't make by hand. I have to get machines to do it for me, which, you know, is okay, but it takes a lot more time away from what 
I could be doing. If I could make it by hand and have machines make it, that'd be perfect. But yeah, we got all this going. It's going, eh, it's burning it pretty fast. Might take it down to one. Might just leave it there for overnight. But yeah, we're going to cut to the morning. This is mainly all I did. Let's do this. I did a lot of upgrades in the MAM. And yeah, Let's see, do we got any yet? Oh yeah, we got two. We got two. Perfect. Alright, I'm going to cut it here. And I'll see you guys in the morning to see how this is... How it has progressed for us. Alright guys, we're back. It's morning time in real life, not in the game. Took a shower, got something to eat, put some clothes on, and we're ready to see what we got going on. So, we're gonna make this I have this going right now so I can get a third third hand I guess so then I can just scroll wheel and go to my different things but we're gonna get this the gun and the uh, two things that aren't highlighted so not the screws but the other two things or what we we're making way over in other factory area so I'm gonna need 50 rotors and 50 re reinforced iron plates and I filled up all of these, so this one, that one, and the wire one over there. And I just let it go all night too with all the all the other stuff. So we got got a lot of materials we can work with. Um, so we're gonna run over here, get that stuff, get the gun, and then I want to run back to the other drop pod, the one that we found in last episode, not the one we found two minutes ago for you guys and I want to see if that one takes power because I've seen people play this game and I've seen them just open it up with power so we're gonna run back to that one see if we have any power but I want to build the gun first because if you guys remember there was a big thing that was shooting fire at me I wouldn't you know I'd like to shoot some stuff back at it so we're gonna see what we can do about that guy and see how much we got. Okay, so not a ton, but yeah, not a ton, but you know, it's okay. Could be worse. We could on. We couldn't even have that built, so could be a lot worse. Slow progress. I need to run back to the base, research the things. I don't know how long it's going to take me to research the ammo, because I have to build ammo for it every time to shoot. And yeah, I think I'm going to cut it because it's going to take a few minutes, 10 minutes or so, to get the gun researched and all that. So I'll start the research and then we're going to cut it. Tool belt has been expanded. Alright, so we just got finished um, making the gun and the ammo from here, and we crafted it in here. That's the, the ammo, there's the gun. Now we have three hand slots, so we have the, the object scanner, my Xeno zapper, and now we have the gun that I have to load. Alright, there we go. I think I can only load one bullet at a time, so I don't know how good it is. If it's like a one shot if you hit them. I don't know if you hit them in the head it'll like do more damage or less damage. I'm not sure. But we're going to run back over here for a second because I forgot something I needed. Run. I need to grab biofuel because we're gonna go check out that other uh, drop pod thingy that we found so we gotta run back over here it's my little storage unit gotta open up the thing get the thing that was in the thing we got the thing run back over here so we put the thing on the thing to activate the thingy which will get us in the thingy yeah that's that's the plan I'm gonna shoot this 
Okay, so it goes pretty far. I crafted like a 145 ammo. So, um, not worried about ammo. I have quite a few for this journey. I saw people get a jetpack, which is cool. Which I kind of want. Because I want to go see what those things are. If I can even get up there. The, like hot air balloon looking things. I don't know. There's a lot I want to do with the jetpack. And I found a, a pond. Which I think will give us power. Because I think it's deep enough in one area. Once we get to coal power. I think it'll be enough. I'm going to grab this guy. I need him for more shards. Perfect. I need to come down here. Well, I wonder if I can kill the, the big guy that killed us over here. It had, like, spikes on it. I'm not going to try to. But, I wonder if I can. Don't worry, we're not going to take the long way to the thing like we did the first time with the cave. We're going to try and go the way that I came back home. Oh, we can test this out. Can I hit him? I don't even know if I hit him. Oh, there we go. Is this one-shotting him? Come here. Oh, I think it is. I think I was just missing. Give me that. Okay, so this gun's actually pretty good. It's nice. Um, I think I want to be up here. Because if not, then I can always just jump down. But I think I want to be up here. Those berries. Oh, yep, I want to be down there. Is that going to kill me? Hopefully not. Nah, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. We got legs of steel. Put that there. Eat some berries. Probably shouldn't have jumped, but oh well. Alright, we're going right through this smoke stuff. Hopefully it doesn't kill us. I think, yeah. Okay. Let's say I think I should be okay. It would be really sad if I died. Because my stuff would have been lost. We're going right up there. And then I think, like, to the left up that way some. That's where we're going to find this. What's that? A little cave way up there. Because I think this is where we left off in the last video. Right here. Right up there is where we left off. And I was trying to find my way home. Because I, yeah, I can see the space elevator through that little hole. So this is right where we were. It's perfect. Need that one too. Trying to get my health back before I go over here. This one should... Oh. Close enough. Alright. So I think I need to go off more... Northeast-ish. I think that's what I said it was. And I think it's like right up here... Um, hopefully I can get up here. Oh yeah, right over there. Perfect. I think it's right over here. And this wasn't the pond I was talking about, but this one, I think I could use this one too. Which is nice. But there's one a little bit closer to my house that I'm going to use instead. There's some guys chasing us. Yep. You want to go, dude? I have a gun. I missed. That one hit him. Okay, so it's not a one shot. Perfect. Uh, put the food back out. Boom. Get my gun ready. Um, is it up, up 
there. Alright, now I, I don't fully remember. Can I jump up here? Yep. Hmm. I think it's more that way. Yeah, we're gonna go up right here where the sand is, because I remember getting the purple slug in the sand, and there were three of the guys that shoot fire, and i super close to dying, but somehow made it out alive. We're gonna have to do a little bit of parkour. Let's get up. Perfect. Um, i jump that way. Oh. Perfect. There we go. Yeah, I think the slug was right in here. And I think it should be right in these uh right in these trees over here. Yeah, because these are the three guys that were shooting me a ton. And I think it should be in the trees right somewhere over here. Hoping I'm close to it and I can find it. And it takes power because I want to open one. Never opened one of these things before. So it's right here. No. Got a big watering hole though. Okay. Is it right there? I think I saw it. I think I saw a tiny, yep, there it is. Alright, perfect. So, I think we're gonna have to kill some animals, some aliens over here. Yeah, like that big guy. Is that the only one here, though? Just do a, do a little perimeter. Um, hope that guy sees me. There's another little guy over there. And I can't aim in. Oh god. Where does Where'd you go? Oh there he is. Come out here, dude. Oh, I hit him with that. Nice. Alright, now you. The guy I was afraid of. And you're hurting me a lot. I wonder if... Oh, no. Yeah, he ran back. God dang it. He keeps moving right as soon as I shoot at him. There, I think that one hit him. That one hit him. I'm about to die. Oh god. Give me some berries. I need more berries. Oh god. I wish I could scan for berries. Because one berry is not going to be enough. There's like none around. There's this one. Hopefully this guy doesn't take too many more shots, because I don't think I can take too many more shots. I think that missed. I think that one got him. That one for sure got him. Look at him, he's like limping. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Oh, I got him! Oh! Man, this guy's cool looking. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Oh, it's only three still? I thought that'd be a lot more because he's big. Alright. Oh, we didn't even grab everything here. We got industrial beams. I think that's the... Yeah, that's the only thing. Oh, nope. We got 21 reinforced plates. Man, that would have been useful. Alright, let's do that. Oh, no, I need one of those. So I think I need something. For everything to open one of these all right we're gonna put this in here turn the power off 
we're gonna cut I'm gonna go make one of these and then I'll see you guys back when I make it back to here all right see ya I made a mistake I ran all the way back to my base and all the way back up here and I got the frame that I needed but I need a heavy one and I only have light ones I guess oh man I should have read that well, time to back it up. Time to go home. Looks like I need some type of wire for the other one and a heavy frame for that one. Which, you know, sucks, but... Oh well. I think... I think once we get back to the base, we are going to just finish out the two last upgrades that we have in the thing which I think are the bounce pads and the the level 2 conveyor belt stuff I think we're just gonna finish those and then I think I'm gonna call the episode there I don't know in the start of the episode we did so good we had so much happening and at the end of the episode I feel so let down my heart has been broken we tried opening up two crates, we didn't have the stuff for either of them. I died on the way back. I think I can survive this. I'm praying that I can survive this. If I bounce off the wall. Yeah, we're good, we barely took any damage. back here I'm angry ha ah. look at him doing a front flip oh god oh god um I don't think I can survive this one can't even like bounce against the wall I don't think oh we barely took any damage again we're good never mind we can survive anything man that sucks that we weren't able to do what I really wanted to do in this episode even though I showed you guys what I built and that's pretty cool but man gonna have to go another day without opening up a crate Watch me die running through here right now. Before we go back to the base, see what upgrades we can get. Am I being. Oh, I'm being healed right now. What is healing? Oh, I think I healed back up to three. Can I go in here? Oh! Are we gonna explore? Oh, it just leads us to this thing. Alright, I think I already have one of these. But I'll take it. Yeah, I saw these leaves and I was like, that looks interesting. And not natural. So I thought they were hiding something. Alright, I'm happy I went in there. Alright, once we get back to the base, we're gonna check the upgrades. I think I'm gonna do all the upgrades I can. Call the episode. I might go off the channel again. Off video and put power into all of the generators that I have that way we make a lot more reinforced plates and iron rods and all that stuff 
think that's what we might do. And in the next episode, I think we're trying to upgrade this. Uh, yeah, I think that's what we're going to focus on in the next one. It's upgrading the space elevator so we can get tier 3 and 4 stuff. Which I can't re... Actually, I don't even know what it gives us. Hopefully it gives us like better miners and constructors that build it faster. Because our miners are doing okay, but the constructors and the assemblers are kind of slow. So it'd be nice to get some more of those. Maybe the jetpack, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get it yet. I feel like that's a, a late to end game thing. Alright, there we go. Hopefully it gives us coal power, so... We don't have to just have all this stuff sitting here. It can be put into things. But now we're back. Let's see what we need for these last two upgrades. 50 of those. Okay. 50 of those. Alright, I'm going to go craft all this stuff, get it all, and then I'll see you guys when I'm back. Alright, we just finished crafting it. Didn't take that long. We only needed the wire, really. So we're going to go in here put all this stuff in here and launch this let Ada talk milestone reach several buildings aimed at factory traversal can now be accessed in the build menu caution is recommended during use of these products all, right, all these foundation stuff this is not what she was talking about though got these walls to make a nice factory this is what she was talking about the jump pads and the tilt jump pads and all this stuff this stuff's pretty cool I like it um, I think we have to wait three minutes before we can yeah for the launch thing to come back so let's craft up some wire or some cables I mean we need a 10. Good enough. Go here. Let's see, what do I need for this? A lot more in 200 biomass. And any more cables. Good. Uh, what did I need for a tilted one? Oh, I can build it. Oh, I need 10 more. 10 more cables, though, because I'm going to use 10. Perfect. All right, we are going to actually we can just use that because I'm not gonna keep this here. So we're just gonna put this there. Uh, put some biomass in it. Oh, I need more cables though because I need to connect that. More cables. We'll get ten more cables. There we go. All right. So let's see, what if I put this... Um, if I launch us this way. Perfect. Can we give it power to this. It's giving it power, good. Hopefully this doesn't damage me. I want to see what the... Yeah, that damages me, okay. Oh, I need two more things and we still got a minute 30 before the next thing comes back so we can run way over here get these two that I need put the jelly launcher thing down and then craft the next upgrade that we need that guy was always bothering me when I ran over here had to, had to deal with him in my own special way. Oh, there's another sphere. Collect that. Oh, hi there. Oh, I missed. All right, we're gonna let that guy live because we're just gonna run over here. Get 25 of them. Keep 75 in there for now. Oh, I still know I have some. Man, I like the trail effect that this thing has. It's like fire, but 
more like sparks, like firework. It's pretty cool. Alright, now we can build the jelly landing pad. I hope this, like, bounces us. I'm not even sure. Oh, okay, we can build that. Say, this needs power too, apparently. I think I can only attach one thing to the biomass burner back there. So I'm gonna have to build one of these. And connect it to that, and then connect it to the things. Which isn't that bad. I can do that. Connect power to this, power to that. I'm gonna have to take some damage because I don't remember where I landed at. Right here. So we're gonna back it up just a small bit. We should about there. Connect that. Whoa. That's weird looking. Alright, let's use the jelly thing and then we can launch the other launch pod thing with the last upgrade that we need that we can get before we have to upgrade the thing. Oh, it just like full on stops you. That's cool. I thought we were gonna miss it there for a second, but you know, it's not bad pick these up so we don't need them anymore we're just testing these out that's me here we go i think i'm gonna set up something right there so i can just launch up to there didn't mean to shoot that all right but we should have enough to get this last upgrade launch it Ada, talk to us please Milestone reached. Oh. Improved versions of conveyor belts and conveyor lifts are now accessible. To encourage additional verticality, conveyor poles now have a stackable variant. Okay, so that's the last upgrade that we can get for all of these. We completed these tiers. We need these, but we have to complete the space elevator phase one. So if we come over here, it shows us what we need to make and smart plating is what we need to make so it takes one router and one reinforced plate actually i might be able to do that this episode 50 one at one i think we have at least 50 over there and 50 over there so if we put down you know what, we're gonna go ahead and craft this and see if we can make it because I think I just need this which I can already make perfect and then if I go what oh I need an iron plate I was like what what is happening why can't I make these so then I think if I grab some iron plates from in here let me grab some what ooh, we need more of that. If I put this just put in that one and that one, boom. Let's make this. If I run over here. Oh wait, hold on. Let's get this some power first. We're just gonna use this thing again, but I need more concrete. Alright, if I put this one like there, and then attach power to it and power, if we turn this off, so we don't want that just wasting power right now, if we run, run back over here, we get 15, or not 15, 50 of each of these, and put it in there. I think we can go ahead and get the upgrade out of the way, and I'm going to grab three of the the power shard things that we have over here so then it goes super quick i think we might upgrade this in that episode too see what upgrades we can get and then we're gonna cut it because it's not going to take us that long to get the stuff that we need because we have this set up over here which is really nice i'm happy i did that Guarantee my things do more damage.
Alright. So we need... Close enough. And 50. Perfect. Ooh. Shot in the air. Perfect. Such a good shot. I'm so good. I should play first person shooters. That's what I should do. Like Valorant. Yeah. Although I'm not that good at Valorant. I like playing it, but I'm not that good at it. So I thought about making videos on it, but eh. Oh, we've got to grab the power shards. That's fine. We'll put it in here. Turn the power on. Grab the power shards from over from these three things and put it in here. So we'll go like that and that. Good. Great. Perfection. Give me this. Turn that on. If it doesn't blow a fuse, say it shouldn't. Run up here, grab these two power shards, and then put in the in the assembler that's making the smart plating that we need for the tower. Yeah. Grab that. Oh, there we go. Man, we're getting a lot done in this episode. I think I need to like. I mean, school's starting up, so. I'm not going to be posting as much. I think this first week I post like five videos, which is a ton. I think I'm going to probably do like two a week, which is good because I need to I need to slow it down. Because I'm kind of hoping this takes me into November. But I still have all of October to go through, so I'm going to need to find something. Because I'm not just going to be making these videos till November. Because that's going to get boring. For you guys. I like playing this game, but if you guys do want me just to make videos until Cyberpunk and Valhalla come out, let me know, and I will. Alright, so after this one is being made, and it's at 50% right now, it should go up really fast. Because it's going, it's going pretty slow right now. I eat. It's made a few of them so far. I think it's made two. Did we blow a fuse? I think we did. Yep, okay. Since that is wanting to put out more than this can handle, we're gonna have to make one of these. Um Put some power in this guy. And we're only using this biofuel because I don't care to make solid biofuel. Oh man. Okay, what if we put more? Surely that has to be enough. Yeah, okay, there we go. We got a lot going. So this should be making it pretty quick now. It was going really slow. Yeah, okay, it's going pretty quick now. It was taking 30 seconds to make one. Now it's only taking 12 seconds to make one. Hopefully it can craft the 50 without have me having to make more. Yeah, we're already at four. All right, we're going to cut. And once we have 50 smart plating in here... I'll come back, we'll turn this thing on, we'll load, seal, and send it, see what happens. Go check out the next upgrades and then see what we do from there. So I'll see you guys in one second. Alright, once this one goes in, we have one more to do. Alright, we're going to turn this off because I don't want it. I don't want it making any more. Because I don't think I need any more smart plating right now. And yeah, I just don't want that on right now. So now that's there, I want to get off the conveyor belt. Seal it. Can't send it yet. Okay, and boom, let's send it off. Okay, got some flashy lights. 
Anything happening? No. Oh. Oh, there it goes. Whoa, it's like way up there now. It's like a tiny little dot on my screen, way up there. Jeez. Alright. Okay. That's a lot of stuff that I don't have. 500 for... Jesus. I'm really gonna need that power. Come on. Coal power. There we go. So yeah, we got coal generator and we have water and all this stuff, but I've never used. I don't really know how to use it. Got a tractor. A truck station. Let's see, what we got in here? Oh, there's the framework. Some steel pipes. Smelts two resources into alloy ingots. Okay, then. Good to know. Do we got anything new in here? Nope. Um, in here? Nope. Alright, well, we got the first upgrade. For the thing. Oh, it's back. I thought it was going to just stay way up there. Alright, well, we got the first upgrade for it. Now we got to get... I think there's only... Yeah, we have to upgrade that one. Yeah, okay, so we got a we got a few upgrades to go. It's probably going to take us a while. Because I need to set up that coal power in as fast as I can over there so I get maximum reinforced plates and stuff. We're going to leave this episode here. We did a lot. We got that set up. We got all of our upgrades. We got the, the gun that I'm using. We got this upgraded. I feel like it was pretty successful. Um, if you liked it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And let me know what you guys want to see. And I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.